Well, I'm in cave one. Let's see how fast I go through the caves. So this is different. That's the thing I like, you know, about uh, Rolex, when it has something different like this. So yeah, the arrows, they, uh, from this, like, you know, tropo, they're a lot less shall I say, and like sort of um, how they sort of work. Less damage, basically. Want that. So there's my ammo up there. I think what I'm going to do right now is going to put this here. And use this if uh, something big and bad comes around. An excellent bow. So basically, as you see, it does more damage. That's basically, basically the key thing to sort of take away from this. The stronger the bow, the more damage they do, but they'll be a bit, be, you know, they'll attack a lot slower. So it's not really a big problem with bows. Excellent round shield. That's worth uh, picking up. There we go. Put that there. So now it doesn't matter what uh, weapons I have equipped. Insta kill. Okay, a ring of speed versus a ring of health. I think we'll leave that alone. Possibly. And you know what? This is probably a good time to start quaffing ID and stuff, so let's see what the blue potion's all about. So, that basically just heals me up. A heal potion. I want to test something. So, blue will heal me, apparently. The Quaff IDing system in this is kind of weak, I think. Could use some improvement. There's that. So these things will probably heal me. Yeah, they'll all heal me, so... That's arcane. That's iron skin. That was a potion of just plain healing. That was restoration. Let's just get rid of all of my potions for now. Hopefully that will make it so that they'll start, you know, IDing properly. Pick this up. Put that right there. Nothing over here. There's a trap, I wonder what it does, but don't want to find out.
very linear cavern. Or mines, whatever you want to call it. Here, I smell or hear or whatever an eye somewhere. You hold her enemy. Oh, that answers where he is. Okay, got him. Where is this enemy? Is that a question? to kill it. We found some evidence of the first expedition. They definitely made it here. We found scraps of their notes scattered about and some of their supplies, but no bodies so far. It's like they've just vanished. What are all in the hammering at the bottom of the level? Which makes more sense. All right, some chainmail or I think dropped somewhere. Find steel mail. Chew. Where's the eye? Ow. Get that. That. Get this. Get those. Get more speed. Spider. Get those. Uh, there's no difference between a chain mail or, or the um, steel greaves there, but whatever. Put those there. Closing in on our level, that's good. Pick this up for now.
Got you. Okay, this is an excellent steel short sword of speed. This one is just an excellent steel sword. I'm thinking the speed is probably better. Because it goes much faster. So I can do more attacks with it. Basically, I can charge up the steel sword faster. So that makes up for the fact that it's uh, got lower damage. That. I think we'll leave that area for just a little bit after I go down here. Oh, that's scary. I and a overhang. Alright, there's something wrong with arrows in this game. They don't work that well. Okay, that's the second time I shot an arrow. I think I hit a wall with it or something and it just died instantly. So, that'd be my, my a major complaint in this game. The arrows don't work very well in closed spaces like that. You can't shoot them around walls easily enough. Oh well. Nothing else to say about that run. It's done. Guess that's it. Take care.